This video is a basic tour of your new Get Connected Volunteer Profile. You can log into your profile from the main volunteer page, and you can also sign up for an account in the same location as well. Once you've used your credentials to log in, you'll be brought through to your volunteer dashboard. The dashboard features a summary of your volunteer activity, including the total number of hours served, total impact value of those hours, the number of volunteer opportunities for which you've registered, and any events for which you've RSVP'd. You can see on this page that we have two navigation panes, one located on the left, which features tabs for opportunities, events, and programs, and one on the top of the page featuring tabs for volunteering, which will take you through to our opportunities, adding hours, your volunteer calendar, your message center, and your profile. We will start with your profile. You can see on our dropdown that we have several options. We're going to start with View Profile. As you can see, all of our tabs here match the same tabs that are located in that dropdown. In our View Profile tab, you can update responses to your volunteer registration track located here. Download your volunteer resume, which is a full listing of all of the programs that you have volunteered for, along with your hours and each opportunity. And you can also update any skills that may be relevant to your volunteer work. Moving to the Edit Profile tab. In this location, you can upload your volunteer photo, change your password, manage your data and communication settings, as well as update basic information that you had filled out when you created your profile initially. You can also deactivate your account should you choose to end your volunteer relationship with the city. Under the track hours tab, you can add hours that you've completed volunteering for different opportunities across the city. And you can also view all previous hour submissions and edit them here by clicking on the pencil. Your volunteer schedule will display your upcoming volunteer opportunities in a calendar format. The My Files tab is a location where you can upload documents that are requested by volunteer coordinators or anything else pertinent to your volunteer assignment. The Opportunity Responses tab will allow you to view all opportunities that you've registered for. We can see we both have active and inactive or previous opportunities listed here. Under the My Teams tab, You'll be able to view information for any teams that you happen to be a part of. The qualifications tab will allow you to view completed qualifications under this heading, as well as any incomplete qualifications that you still need to complete to register for different volunteer opportunities. Last but not least, we have our inbox tab, which has a full record of every communication that you receive through Get Connected. Now we'll move to the left navigation pane. By clicking the Opportunities tab, you'll be able to view and explore all opportunities for every volunteer program throughout the City of Fort Worth. To learn more about an opportunity, simply click on that Opportunities tile and it will take you through to give a more thorough description, additional details, as well as a button that you can click to register for that opportunity. Under the Events tab, you'll be able to view any events for all Fort Worth volunteer program. One important distinction between events and opportunities, events are going to be those volunteer activities for which you can log volunteer hours. Events, are activities that you are not able to log volunteer hours for. These are things like recognition dinners and appreciation events. Looking now at the programs tab, we can see uh, that this lists all volunteer programs with the city of Fort Worth. 
similar to opportunities, you can learn more about a program by clicking on its tile, where you can view additional information about the program, information to contact that program's coordinator, location. You can also see that program's specific opportunities, as well as some great photos of our current volunteers. Thank you for watching this video, and please don't hesitate to contact City of Fort Worth Volunteer Programs with any questions. We look forward to working with you.